It never ceases to surprise me just how many of our sayings are based on naval slang. A good example of this is three sheets to the wind, used to describe someone really drunk or out of control. Well, where did this come from? To answer that, we have to go back to sailing ships during the age of sail. Unlike your bed, sheets aboard a ship were ropes connected to the corners of the sails. As the ship sailed, the sails would have to be trimmed, meaning tightened or slacked based upon the angle the wind was hitting it. To sail most efficiently, ships would want to catch as much of the wind as possible, so would slack or tighten ropes called braces, which rotated the yard, the big horizontal pole that the sail sat on. Depending on the new angle the wind made with the sail, the sail would then need to be retrimmed to keep them efficient. This allowed them to sail efficiently even if they weren't sailing with the direction of the wind. The goal of trimming was to keep the sail just tight enough that it filled with wind. If it was too tight, it wouldn't catch much wind and would sail inefficiently. If it was too loose, it would flap in the wind like a flag, catching no wind. Hence the sail was to the wind when it was loose, the sail flapping and useless. The largest of sailing ships had three sets of sails. So if a ship was three sheets to the wind, all its sails were flapping and useless, and the ship was out of control just like a sailor who was three sheets to the wind, drunk and out of control.